I don't want you to change. I just want you to think. So today's Civic Innovation Challenge on the Opportunity Gap represents an extremely complex problem with no clear one solution. And if we can present these opportunities for students so they can begin getting used to tackling these types of problems, they're going to be getting prepared to thrive in a world of uncertainty. Today, uh, the Noble Impact students uh, came in and listened to a conversation with Minnie Jean and her daughter, Spirit. And now we're discussing the opportunity gaps that many students face and all the problems associated with that. And we're going to try and come up with solutions to solve those problems. What I think about Minnie Jean's presentation was it was very inspiring. And it was, you know, it moved me to a point that I can change something in the world. I'm, I'm, I'm glad it's happening in Little Rock. Um, it's a site where it needs to happen. And maybe it can be a model for the country. So whenever I see um, ways and means of trying to use the voices of our young people, I'm really pleased. They're asking and trying to attack the same type of problems that their teachers and administrators are doing but instead of from their point of view, from a student's point of view. You mentioned some of the values and skills and implementing these in school. I'm curious, how would you see that actually taking hold? I think that this is really cool. And it's more like comfortable, so it makes you, you know, want to talk and like, you get the opportunity to meet a lot of people and they help you out. It's more about who you are and just giving that sense of, I'm important. We came here because of the idea of freedom and the idea that you guys can do anything you want to. You can be whatever you want to and you're starting now. You took on some pretty serious problems. So I encourage you to do more of this. I say just keep going.